Our first guests are Natalie and Zachary Wilch, two more of the wonderful performers of the Initiative CD, from the Initiative CD. And uh, Zach also has his own band, By the Lake, and we're going to listen to some songs, some very cool songs by uh, Zach and his band, By the Lake. Think, um, think Radiohead with a unique Zach Wilsh combo melody and lyrics. It's kind of Radiohead-ish, but it's all Zach. You'll see what I mean when you hear By the Lake's songs. And we're going to hear uh, Natalie's beautiful rendition from the Initiative CD, Can't Get Your Face Off My Mind. And I can't get my mind off the Initiative CD. Have you noticed, everybody? This CD is just incredible. And we've been um, you know, talking about it the last few weeks. And Natalie and Zachary both perform on the Initiative. And like I said, Zach's got his band by the lake that we're going to listen to a few songs from them, too. Okay? Now... <clears throat> The cool thing, when I say Zachary and Natalie, they're married couple, recently married. So that's going to add another little dimension to our interview. As a matter of fact, why wait any longer, everybody? Let's get right to it. Zachary and Natalie Wilksh, the married Zachary and Natalie Wilksh. And we are joined, everyone, by Zach and Natalie Wilkes, and they are first. I first heard of uh, Zach and Natalie Wilkes from the uh, incredible CD, the initiative that we've been speaking about for the last few weeks. Um, first of all, Zach, Natalie, welcome to the show. Hey, thank Hi. you. How are you? I'm doing very well, thank you. And uh, Zach is the son-in-law. Uh, Mr. Joe Mantica, uh, the uh, the driving force behind the initiative, and Natalie, he's your dad, correct? That's right. Okay. Now, uh, why don't you tell us first of all, Zach, a little bit about your uh, musical background? Uh, what what I know the song we're going to listen to from the initiative. Uh, there's some pretty mean piano, very cool keyboarding. But how did you get your background in music, Zach? Let's start with you. Um. Well, I grew up. Uh, within like a musical family, mum like made us play piano when we were very young. But after a few years, we started to like really love it for ourselves. And like me and my my brothers, and um, me and my brother Jacob ended up starting a band when we got a bit older. Um, it's kind of like alternative sort of indie stuff that we got into. And um, yeah, so and then we started I don't know just recording songs and. And we, we did an EP, so, um, yeah. And that, uh, Natalie, I guess growing up in a household with, uh, with your dad, Joe, it, it's kind of inevitable that you would get into music, right? Yeah, of course. We'd, um, every time we'd come up from Mildura, we would go to all of Dad's gigs, and, of course, we were very exposed to the 80s and the rock and roll music, which I just love. And, oh, one of my favourite memories is receiving, um, Dad would call it Nat's Pick, and we would have all different volumes, and I'd actually get CDs full of old songs. So I was really educated in that style of music, yeah. Well, I'll tell you, it, um, it certainly comes out in your dad's, in your dad's work. I mean, I, I listened to um, his, the other album, A Thousand, a Thousand Miles, too. And yeah. your dad has such a great pop sensibility. And um, Zach, you, have, uh, you guys have a few songs that were, besides the one from the initiative we're going to share, I actually want to listen to one right now. It's called You Are Fair. What can you tell us about that one? Um, well, this whole EP was probably like uh, very dynamic, kind of, with like softs and louds and stuff. Um, it was a bit of a... Uh, I don't know, it's a bit of a melancholy kind of sounding EP um, and it's just very uh, lyrical, I guess, and kind of a bit of a storyline to it, um, just about like, a, a, I guess, a love story with a guy struggle with a, a love story, so yeah. It's the universal language, right, Zach and Natalie? Oh, it, really is. it is, it is. <laughs> okay, why don't we listen to it right now? You are fair.
sickness in the morning reminds you of his touch. So cold on your bare skin, like the promise of my love. In the darkness that persuades you. Come on in Is where I left you And the hope you had in me Tell us about um, your band, By the Lake. Uh, you Are Fair comes from the EP entitled The Finished. Tell us about your band, By the Lake. Um, well, By the Lake started just with me and my brother um, writing songs together. Um, and it, we, we really loved like all of the sort of indie alternative rock like in the mid-2000s, just like Radiohead and... Um, a heap of other bands like that and we loved uh i don't know just the melancholy feel of songs as well and just really like uh bringing out the emotions in in the music and the lyrics and kind of pairing them together so um we wrote this ep kind of i guess through that influence i guess and uh yeah we really enjoyed writing it and we recorded some of the songs um just in our own house actually just with our own setup and then we we went and mixed it in a in a studio and and got it all mastered and and pressed and got it on itunes and um 
yeah, so we played a, played a few gigs around the time and um, we're probably going to do something in the future again. Um, but me and my brother both got married in the last year, so we've had a bit of a, a year or two off. So <laughs> that, that, that does change lives a little bit, right, Natalie? <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah, for the better, of course, for the better, absolutely. That's right, that's right. <laughs> and now you mentioned, Zach, uh, you can get the, the finished EP by, on iTunes. Okay, we made, uh, our listeners can just search for "By the Lake," the name of the group, yep. and the finished yep. EP. Speaking of CDs, uh, let's get to the initiative. And, and Natalie, you're probably more of a um, more of an expert on this because your dad is, was the driving force behind it. The initiative. Uh, I've had your dad on and Grace Marino, and um, it's really just a wonderful, it's great pop sensibilities. What can you tell us about Can't Get Your Face Off My Mind, which is such a beautiful delivery by you, the song that uh, you <laughs> Thank you. Well, um, I was sort of on the other end of the phone listening to um, Dad rave on about all the different recordings, and so ours was actually the last song to be recorded, and... I'm sort of sitting there with my brother going, am I going to get on this album? Like, I've just listened to all of these fantastic demos of all the people you've already had on the show. And it was hilarious that um, my brother and dad came up to visit and we all sitting in the lounge room and he then in fact asked me if he'd like, if I'd like to sing one of his songs. So it was just great just sitting in the lounge, just mucking around sort of, and then to go into a studio and finish it off and see the result was just an amazing experience, yeah. Mm. And your brother is Matthew. Yeah, Matthew. He actually co-wrote the song. All of those fancy chords in there are by him because he's a wonderful guitarist. <laughs> mm-hmm. And yeah. uh, before we listen to the song, I'd, I'd love to quote a line or so from it. You showed me love that you tried not to hide. Threw a smile just for me. Took a while, but I could see that I can't get your face off my mind. Great, great, uh, great lyrics. And I must say, I mentioned it earlier, Zach, very cool keyboards in this song. So um, <laughs> oh, thank you very much. <laughs> why don't we listen to it right now from the Initiative CD? Natalie and Zachary Wilkes, Can't Get Your Face Off My Mind.
Oh, such a great song. Can't Get Your Face Off My Mind. Uh, Natalie and Zach, Zachary Wilk. And from the Initiative CD. And listeners, uh, if you want to uh, more information about, first of all, the Initiative CD, just go to facebook.com backslash the Initiative JM. Uh, JM, initials for Nat- Natalie's father, Joe Mandica. And. Um, Zach, I'm so happy you sent me a few a few of your songs from uh, from By the Lake. Uh, tell us about Variables. Um, Variables is a bit more of a piano driven song, um, and it's kind of like a, a continuing story from um, from the first song, and it's kind of just a progression of uh, the the guy's struggle with. Just um, his love and letting her go and wanting her back, I guess. So yeah. it's not it's not about me, okay? No, it's not about that. No, let's, let's I didn't know that. Zach. Man. <laughs> let's get that and, straight and, right now. And it's not autobiographical either. It's, uh, <laughs> it's very much a fictional story. So yeah. Zach, you do realize now that you're married, every single one of your upcoming songs has to be upbeat and happy. You realize that, oh, don't God, you? I know that. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> Let's listen to variables and then we'll get Zach in some more trouble when we get back. <laughs>
Uh, you know, we did kid about it. That was variables. But, um, yeah, what what uh, kind of a silly question. I've been married a couple years longer than you guys, um, uh, 33 years. So I, I, I kind of have my answer to this question. But what? how has marriage changed your lives? Natalie, I'll, I'll throw this one to you. Well, it's it's funny coming from two different musical families and very different styles to be married again, and that's probably one of our biggest goals this year is to collaborate and get together and start writing music. So, I mean, marriage does change everything, but I think definitely for the better, definitely brings us closer and, yeah, into the raw just to start putting stuff on paper. I, I, well, I agree. I mean, if I had to choose between marriage and single, marriage is definitely way, definitely way, yeah, easy for me to say, definitely the way to go. Okay, Zach, now you're on the spot. Tell us how this past year ha- has been for you. Um, well, I reckon it's just, it's been really great. I've just loved it and just being able to relax into marriage. And um, yeah, so we, we didn't do heaps of music this year. Like we picked up the guitar a few times. Um, but we're, yeah, we've worked on a couple of songs, but we're going to sit down a bit more seriously. We've got a goal to like, you know, do a certain amount of songs this year. And, um, I think we're starting to get the feel for each other as well, like with our different musical tastes, but bringing them together to mix something that, that is a, I don't know, different again, I guess. Yeah, I mean, seriously, it does open up a whole new area of, uh, of where your psyches are both coming from when you're writing music. Yeah, it totally does, yeah. And it's like you have to kind of, um, I guess, not let let what you've done before go or how you used to write songs. But, yeah, as well as being married because you're relaxed and happy, you've got to, if you've, um, if you've written in a certain different light, like, say, a melancholy light, you can, you ha- you, it's possible to find a new way of writing, say, in with, uh, you know, more happy or upbeat songs. So, yeah. Yeah, and uh, but but seriously speaking too, you know, marriage has its ups and downs. So, Natalie, don't get upset with Zach if he writes something a little down, you know, every once in a while, <laughs> because he he will come out of it. Okay, see Zach, I got you back. I got you back on that one, Zach. Sure, no problem. <laughs> um, once again, we're speaking with Natalie and Zach Wilch, two really talented talented young musicians and singers and Zach's uh, EP called The Finished EP. His group is By the Lake and that's available on iTunes. And I first became aware of, uh, of these two talented people from the initiative CD. Um, the driving force behind that, Joe Mandica, Natalie's dad. And you can find all the information you need for the initiative CD at facebook.com backslash the initiative jm um zach and natalie we're uh before we say goodbye uh we're gonna listen to another song by you insurance um and uh, will you do me a favor when the when the song snippets is finished could you get back to us on that as well <laughs> yeah okay <absolutely. laughs> okay Oh, uh, listeners, we, <laughs> Zach was telling me the names of some of his songs before this for the listeners, and I kept thinking that Snippets was the name of one of his songs, and he was trying to tell me, just play some snippets to these songs. But anyway, <laughs> we want to listen to the whole songs because they're, they're wonderful. <laughs> um, uh, tell us about the song Insurance. Um, the Insurance is, I don't know, it's a bit of a heavy, heavy subject, this last song, because it's it's basically the guy at the end of his rope um, with the last song. So it's sort of like um, him just saying goodbye to the girl, I think, in in a roundabout way. Um, And, yeah, so it's a a bit of a darker song, but, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. (laughs) Oh, I'm I'm sure we will. And we're going to say goodbye with the song, but before we do, um, Zach and Natalie, do you guys perform together? Yeah, well, actually, we're a part of um, a part of our church group. We've got a couple of gigs in schools, which is pretty cool. We've got a band that we go in and do some covers, so that's been a great experience um, in 2013. But yeah, hopefully this year we get to pull out more of our originals and yeah, start performing as a duo. Yeah, and where can people get in touch with you if they'd like to see where you're playing or just keep on keep on uh, keep on top of things? 
Well, um, I'd, I'd imagine Facebook probably. Yeah. Um, well, you, By the Lake has a Facebook page, which is uh, Facebook slash By the Lake Music. Okay. Um, so we'll probably post things on there or even on the initiative page, we'll probably post things on there as well because people know us through that as well. So. Okay, and, and listeners, all this information will be on our website at planetludwig.com as well. So uh, you can always just go to the website and get this information. Um, Natalie and Zach, it really has been a pleasure meeting you, albeit by, uh, over the phone, but um, hopefully we can speak again sometime. And uh, I really want to thank you so much. I know it's early there in Australia, early in the morning or, or mid-morning. Um, mid-morning. Mid morning, but uh, thank you both so much. It's been a real pleasure speaking with you. And we're going to finish off with a song called Insurance. And uh, Natalie, Zach, once again, it was a pleasure and thanks for being on the show. Thank you so thank much you for know. having us. Thank you. Uh, okay, we hope to speak again sometime. Yeah. Get down on the floor, baby. Get down on the floor Get down on the floor With your hands up in surrender See, I can't love like God It's too much of a risk If I gave you a choice You'd spit back in my face Get down on the floor.